Hello, everybody. Welcome back to more Inscription Casey's Mod. We are on challenge level three, which means we need 30 challenge points. So to get 15 here and 15 here with the new one. So we're, we're going to have to do boss battles. Also, our totem battles, which is a little yikes, a little yikes. We're also going to have to do, I mean, we don't have to. We could also do three of these instead. But this is what I'm going to do because it's new. We'll try it out. Start all battles with one damage on your side of the scales. That might not sound like that big of a deal. But I assure you that is going to become a problem. Okay, I yes, we are starting with rabbit pelts again. I got informed why that is. I want to explain this because this this surprised me. I did not know why we start because we started with ringworm and the badger last time. And that apparently is because I logged in to get a screen grab of the new stoat since it has a different picture, you know. Uh, for the thumbnails for the series, and I quit my run immediately. So if you don't ever make it, if you do not beat the first boss, then apparently you get some other cards instead of the pelts. I don't know if they're always those ones, because that would be kind of really strong, those cards, but hey, are your pelts clean? Here we go. We are into it. Warren. Warren is interesting. Ah, it's whenever it's... I mean, yeah, maybe. We could go with... If there were two ants here, I would I would maybe give it a go. Wolf Cub is actually quite nice, I would say. Beaver is interesting. It's, I wish it didn't cost two. Don't know what the mirror does still. I do know what the bell does now. Um, I'm leaning towards Mantis. Bifurcated is just so strong. So, like, let's take the Mantis for one. You can't sacrifice the dam. War God, Warren would be so much better if it had three health. Because it costs one. So it needs to be able to take a hit and summon the thing. And then in that case, it's, like, very good. Can you... Wait, can you sacrifice the Warren? Wait. Part of me wants to just try it out. Let's just try it out. For the sake of newness, these are exquisite. My thanks. We'll we'll try it out. We'll just give it a shot. And let's go upgrade something like Mad right off the bat. And if it gets eaten, it gets eaten. It just gets removed from our deck, and that's honestly fine. Obviously, Mantis is an interesting first start. Don't want to. I don't want to kill off the wolf really want to kill off this bullfrog. Well. We could risk the biscuit, like, right off the bat. We'll upgrade it once. Do we want to push it? I'm stupid. All right. <laughs> Imagine, though. The bones are yours. We're screwed, man. That, that was rough. Okay. But that's fine. I feel like we've kind of been leaning on bifurcated or try try strike anyway. Ringworm and worker ant, I'm not too concerned about. If we put down the stoat, that's like good enough already to solve this situation. Okay, we got another ant. I do want to probably kill this ant. Otherwise, we're going to get overrun. A little too quickly. Could obviously strike it empty. But as soon as this gets down here, then... Yeah, no, let's uh, let's kill this. Let's invest in our future. Let's not be uh, a greedy Gus just for the kicks and wiggles of it. Okay. Drop down the bullfrog. We managed the, uh, the plus one on the, the scale just fine here. Like, you know, in some fights, it's just not going to be a big thing at all. Warren. So let's see this. So we do have to sacrifice for the Warren. That's the weird thing. But then we do get the rabbit to make it kind of free. Can you sacrifice the Warren? I would assume you can. But I guess we don't we don't get to find out right now. It's fine. Alright. What do we do? Move up towards the campfire, sacrifice another thing. We can just like we, risk reward we can either get a st really strong card or we can thin deck both situations are pretty good 
Oh, let's go. That's actually very lucky. Uh, where's the next shop? We don't know yet. But yeah, that, see what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? We either get a really strong card or our deck is thinner. Which is good for later. So... Yeah, same deal. I honestly like this. Okay. Yeah, I... Hold on. An early campfire. I, I think we're I think we're discovering a little meta here. Uh, it's either the card becomes strong or it's removed from the deck. And both of those things in the deck builder sense are good. Those are both good things to have happen to us. We want that to be uncontested. Oh, wait, it's not... Oh, we have fly guard. It's not uncontested then. But, okay, so we were down one, then we went up three, so we were plus two, then we went down one, so we would need to do four damage. We can't, we cannot win this turn. I could, well, I could with the squirrel. Or with the tooth yank. Let's save our stuff, though. We should have just put it over here to begin with. I just, for some reason, I wanted it uh, wanted it over there. I thought it would be fine. We win anyways. Right? Yeah, we win here. Not that strong of a win, but it's okay. I have, I have a golden pelt already. Kind of cracked. Okay. Rat King Alpha. I'm not immediately too drawn to any of this. These bone costs are a little too high. Like, if we could take all of these at the same time, uh, maybe. Is there anything that... Let's, let's re-roll. River Snapper. Cockroach. I'm going to take the Cockroach because the infinite life idea sounds really nice. Health. Okay. Yeah, sa same deal. Either the stoat is uh, is OP, or we don't have to have the stoat in the deck anymore. Okay. He's not really OP. He's 1-6, but a 1-6 is so much better than a 1-2. Uh, it's not even funny. Because that means it is, it's good fodder. Lying. Oh, this is a wee bit goofy. We have flight block... Okay, so theoretically this is fine. Theoretically we don't die here, and the tail should be like what a one. Okay. Poison and flying. That's kind of funny. Uh. Hmm. Can't really do anything here. Uh, Stoat is not going to be anything yet. This is going to move over. We're going to kill the tail. This is fine. We're still. This is still a win for us. Truthfully, uh, put down the stoat. Good. 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 That's a dub. We got a dub. Send it. All right. So far, so fine. So far, so fine. New new brain meta on how to value these campfires is really, really shaking things up. Huh. <sighs> Okay. All right. Yeah. This sets us up to basically we have a chance for a dupe if we want it. Oh, we get a pack rat. I, uh, 
That's the thing. We really do have to sacrifice our stuff more, use our items more. All right. Uh, these are the things we can add to. Tempted to sacrifice the Warren and put it on the stoat just so he's just like he's like a good turn one value engine you know obviously putting putting the pack ride on like the cockroach is kind of nice but I, yeah I like the idea of because I'm not going to play the warren itself really this is a good way to make our deck a little bit thinner and the stoat is just a very good turn one card to play now I, I really would have preferred to fight this boss later. I think this is probably the easiest boss, if I were to be honest. Alright. Birds have scoot over. End of the turn, they move in that direction. Kingfisher. All right. Good start. All right. I don't know. You will you even yank them? Nope. Oh, this is this is the problem. Yeah, that's the problem. That's the problem indeed. Should have played an item. Man. Alright, um This is good though. This is good though. We, we we've solved our our situation. Oh come on! Okay, okay, okay. Uh what do we want? Bullfrog is a 3-2. Oh, that solves it. One, two, three. Do we need to yank? One, two, three. Theoretically, that's perfect lethal. All right, good stuff. What you got for me? Uraiuli. I never play with Uraiuli. It's just because it's so expensive. It's so hard to get that value out. Strange larva. I like the strange larva. Child 13 is just really good too. I'm taking child 13. All right, good stuff. I'm excited. Uh, we have more unlocks for those, and apparently over the course of time, they're going to add more. All right, what do we got? I don't really want to... Well, we could merge the wolf, and then we could use the cockroach. Because the cockroach is just going to turn it to a 2-2. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that because we have the merge station up there. Same deal here. Same deal as always. What what do we not really... So, if, yeah, if we're going to combine the wolves and I'm going to sacrifice a cockroach, we'll see. I'll, I'm either going to have an incredible cockroach and uh, I'll, I'll... Yeah, I'll change my mind. Or, yeah, that's fine. Either a three one cockroach with an like infinite usage, or uh, we have one less cockroach and we'll just use the one we have because we already had too many. Truthfully, uh, ooh, this sucks. Ooh, this sucks. Okay. We lose if we don't do something here. 
We need to be retaliatory. Retaliatarian. Are you for real here? Uh, okay. Because then he's going to come down, he's going to kill. Wait, I think we have this without using any ingredients. Oh god, this is this is this is big gamble. It also requires us to wait, no, let's No, we have a space, okay. Oh, this is big gamble. But that gives us four perfect. Please don't have any more Oh, you have a flyer. You dirty boy. One, two, three, and then he'll do one, two, three. So we're fine. Or better yet. Oh, that's right, we get the rabbit. Um, doesn't really do anything for us. All right, all right, all right, we've, we've done it. No, ah, you gotta be kidding me. We're actually mostly fine with this, <laughs> like mostly fine with it. Go do this, do one damage, and then they do one, two, puts me down at one. But then next turn, I. Get down, we get three bones. Oh, come on, man. Uh, We could get five, we could do five now. I don't really want to do that, because we have to sacrifice this. Don't. I'm thinking we, sac we put down the rabbit sack, the pack rat and the rabbit to kill the sparrow with the wolf. That puts us up at three to death. I, I don't, yeah, I don't really love this, but I think I'm, I think I'm right. Please don't have any more units. If you, if you have no more units, then we do win this. All right, good stuff. Cheese them. Cheese them. Good. I don't know. Kill him for the fun of it. All right. All right, all right, all right. Beautimus Maximus. All right, combine first, right? I think we combine first because it's less likely that we're gonna get it later. It gives me, it both, it's a buff of one of my cards and, and it removes a card from my deck. That being said, it also means we have one less solid value card, just like a nice clean value, but we put bifurcated on that wolf and uh, baby, you got a stew going. Eesh. Interesting. Not a good draw. We take the one damage to try and 
retaliate next turn? I think so. Ugh! Stoat, please? Not good. Um... Do we let that become a Papa Wolf? We die. We die if we do this. If we send like this. Okay. He's gonna turn into Papa Wolf, but. It's fine adjacent. I think it's fine. We generate bones. And more importantly, I think we win here. Yeah, we win here. All right. And we also get a scissors. Ooh. All right. And we don't have the buff on that makes it so, um, or the, I guess the nerf on that makes it so we, um, have more expensive. Ooh. Get another shot at combining the cockroach. Another shot at buffing the cockroach for another, like, super strong one, too. Sure. Sure. I like that idea. Because if we can, like, infinitely... Yeah, there's another combined up there. Eh, we can just combine our cockroach. Easy enough. We didn't know that yet, but hey. We have no elk. We have no elk. We have no grace. We got some... We got cockroach buff. Mantis, cockroach, mantis. Fine. Fine, 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 fine. We'll see what we can do with that. Maybe we can... That, that might be Borkin. Oh, what the heck? Double combined. Boom, boom, boom. It's going to move there. Okay. We just get the. Oh shoot! Oh wait! Uh, 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 wait! Come down! It comes down, it attacks, and then it moves over. Oh screw you! There's nowhere I can put him to not have him die. Okay, it's an investment for next turn, I guess. Well, maybe we wait then. If we, if we, there's nowhere we can put him where we can't kill him, there's no point to put him down right now. He does zero damage in the moment. Attack, attack. We take one damage, which is bothersome. Okay, so now... Now... Put down child 13 and a squirrel. And we sacrifice, sacrifice, put down the wolf. Do we want him to turn around? We don't want him to turn around, so we want to put him here to lure the wolf over. Alright. Also, do we just win? No. Wolf. So we want him to move over because then we get a free shot with the wolf. All right, we won. We won, we won, we won, we won. Woo! Clean. Clean and easy. Nice. God, the wolf card is just really good. Merging, I tell you. Oh, there's a chance. Okay, we're, we're looking for a dupe. We're looking for a dupe. 
Amalgam? What? <laughs> Pecrine is a dupe, though, but... I gotta take it. I, You have my gratitude. I have to take it. I don't know what it is. It's new. Oh, wait. We can combine... Okay, so I don't really want to do two of these. Let's do this first, and then we'll go to the mushroom. That's actually ideal. All right. Um, obviously, bifurcated wolf. It's fantastic. It's very, it's a very easy win. But again, we want to make sure that we have easy wins across the board. So I'm leaning towards buffing up bullfrog with bifurcated because now now this is a win condition that's a that's a turn one win condition now we want to do this because we can combine our cockroaches making them not that much stronger really maybe it does something better I don't know maybe but I'm assuming it's just a 2-2 two -two. yeah it's not that exciting it's, it's certainly... Uh, a 2-2 two -two is a lot better than a 1-1. One -one. Like, it's... I would go as far as to say it's... It's more than twice as good. <laughs> okay. Okay. Do not care about that. We got lucky there. Prospector. Alright. We can win on turn one, but then our bullfrog dies. That's fine. We take those. Okay. Now it's a wee dog. All right, uh, what's the only thing? There are no cards of mine you can cut yet. All right, well, we'll force you to skip your next turn so that we have some value to get out of Pack Rat. What? The true appearance is frightening even to me. What? Repulsive. If a creature would attack a card bearing this sigil, it does not. What the hell? Pass. God. Uh, absolutely easy. <laughs> Bodied. Destroyed. Does leave what I think is, I personally think is the toughest boss for last. I mean, it's just, it's just fundamentally broken. Mantis God is just, it's a broken card. It's so strong. All right, snow line. We haven't been doing too great on these. Bone cost, probably not. Blood cost, ugh. I would say probably health. Okay, we <laughs> You'll have to see it. Wait. What? Did... Did the Deathless actually wait, huh? Touch of death on a zero one. Not too great. A possum actually is not bad. It's like it's a god tier chump blocker. If it's if nothing else. And honestly, and it is nothing else.
Why did two cockroaches show up? Because there's only one there now. Okay. Uh, okay, here's the thing. Obviously, trifurcated wolf sounds really good. Maybe we do have two cockroaches in our deck, though, and it's just showing one. Because we have two pack rats. Well, we don't actually. Trifurcated cockroach is actually, like, that's really strong. At 2-2. At two, two, see, that's the thing. A 2-2 two, two attacking three times versus a 1-1 one, one attacking three times. That's, we have three cards. You may be noticing, I'm, I'm, I'm focusing very intently on one specific number, and that number is six, because that's our new one-turn kill lethal. Six is our, our OTK lethal at this point. Oh, this is concerning. Well, not anymore, actually. I forgot we have I forgot we had bifurcated. <laughs> I was like our bullfrog is good, but see that's the thing. That's why you want to spread spread the strength of everything across your whole team. No, we only have one cockroach. Wait, also that crazy card is gone. Look at it. see, look how thin our deck is. That's been very intentional. Same, we're, we're going to send the opossum to the fire. I would not be uh, too beefed if I don't get this. Oof. It's this, if anything. Okay. Yeah, we got it. Ooh. Ooh. That's pretty good. All right. Yeah, opossum. There's a chance. Here's the thing. It's just like a uh, HP. Who do I not really need? Tempted to ditch our pack rat. Here's the thing. Yep. He's either a 2-6 or we uh, get rid of him. And both both are options I'm fine with. We have a very concentrated deck. I'm treating the fires like they're either... It's a 50-50. It's either an incredible buff or it's card removal. Why do we have two stoats? One of these is a faker. Okay. That's so cool. Okay. Thanks for the dub. This is, see, this is what I'm talking about. You, this is where I've been aiming for a thin deck this whole time, and we, we've gotten it. We've really, really have the thinnest deck of all time. I don't have any pelts. I must give you this. You have to buy some pelts. I, I didn't want any. We have not uh, finished up this yet. We have the insect head. Uh, insect sacrifice for triple? Seems great. We don't have that much stuff to take. S we really don't need that. The wolf is the only thing that that's relevant on. So maybe the gecko tail? We only have one bug. It's literally the, the cockroach. Honestly, the cockroach sacrificing for three is good, and then we can set up so something for the future. Because it's an it's a infinite life cockroach. So that that 
we can be a little bit more comfortable going for spicy things. In fact, we can even get like the triple cost and intentionally go for that. Oh my god, it was you. It was you all along. <laughs> Just come on, man. Cracked. Do I have any combos? I don't actually have two opossums. This into double combine actually is really good, though. I'm intentionally looking for somebody I already have. Raven. <sighs> Don't love that. Cause this is gonna give me this is gonna give me a dupe. Basically, I'm going to add a 1-2 one, two, one, two to my bullfrog. I'm going to add 1-1 one, one to my possum. I'll, I guess I'll add this to my bullfrog so it has a little bit more health. Mostly. We did end up getting the elk that I didn't really want. But that's fine. It's, it's really the only... Sort of the only bloat in my deck is kind of the is the elk right now so it's pretty good wait until i have something to cut i didn't do anything yet okay so we uh we're gonna try and abuse bifurcated because if Opposing. Did you even read? Someone left that comment. Says opposing. Sorry, it's logical to think that the person who kills the trap would be the one affected by the trap. Did you even read? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, oh boy. Okay. Uh, let's think about this. We we have good stuff going on here. I kind of want something to die though. Probably the possum. Oops, wait. Oh, shoot. I got got. I got got by my own guy. Well, he's gonna die. That's not... That sucks. I don't want to put down the child yet. I also don't want to just straight up lose here. Uh, you know what? When is this honestly going to be more useful than right now? Oh, it's that's right. It's stinky. It actually kind of... Well, no, it doesn't suck that much. It's fine. Okay. Possum dead. Doesn't really matter. Gives me a pelt. Oh my god. I'm going to farm pelts. Oh, there's a wolf cup. We could win if we won. <laughs> like, on this turn here, probably. Okay, so that's gonna die. This doesn't work. This actually doesn't work that well. 
can sacrifice the child. I just want to have infinite, you know? We're going to have all the pelts. I'm going to buy everything you have. I will buy your entire stock. We do have to kill these. That is the that is the thing. But how much do we have? The opossum, squirrel, we have the child. Okay. Alright. Awesome. Awesome. Squirrel. <laughs> Just guys. Okay, there we go. We get one trap there. The stinky is causing a problem. Stinky caused a problem. Trying to get that killed. Get kill. Kill. Pelt. I'm trying to get as many pelts as I can. I want to buy everything. I will take your entire stock. So that's a pelt. And then this is a pelt. That's about as good as I think I'm going to be able to get it. I think that's as good as I can get. Wait, what? Why did they attack at the same they attacked at the same time. Whatever. We got plenty of pelts. We got four. Well, we're gonna have... We're going to have four. Alright, let's just think here. I think we just take both of these lines and win. This is... Yeah, win it. Alright, I mean, I think we just won, so... We just need to literally... We need to not play something here, because it's a trap, because Bloodhound... We literally need to just do nothing. We win if we do nothing. Don't touch anything! Just do it! <laughs> Alright. Clean. This has been a bloodbath today. I watched me get schooled in the final boss, though. But this has been an absolute bloodbath. It's been the this has been the easiest run so far, <laughs> which is so funny. Do I have a pack rat? Still, I can't. It won't let me check. I don't think I have a pack rat. I think I, I think I let him die in the fire. <laughs> uh, strange larvas, all right. I just, I don't want anything that costs more than one, really, right now. Can I cut the moon? I've never tried to just use the scissors on the moon. Um. Mothman doesn't need... I mean, the wolf doesn't need this either, but... Hey, sure. I, I, There was a justification for potentially taking an item. I am concerned. Smoke is just so good for us. Though. Oh my god, you got bifurcated? Wait, what's bifurcated? Uh, is it insects? 
Okay, Mole Man to start. We want right here. Blocks the damage. Wait. We like almost lose right away. We might need to cut this card. Wolf Cup. I'm trying to think. What do we have in our entire deck? Because we might have the answer to this here. Ironically, if we just put something right here that does a little bit of damage, we are fine though. We can't have bifurcated like I want. Okay. should have got the wolf. We should have got the wolf because we could have attacked this. Yeah, we should have just got the wolf. We could have put down smoke bullfrog. I think we're fine anyways. Got four. One. He needs to, he, he just needs to be here. Oh, God, we really should have just got the wolf. We can cut the card if we wanted. So we can put down Child, do two damage, so two damage, three damage, Bullfrog does four damage, Kills does four damage, takes the one hit from this, so it only does three. Okay, this is so freaking goofy. It's extremely goofy movie. Possum just helps us take a hit. All right, we're fine. This is so strange, but we—it we, is so so strange. Oh my! It was lethal. Oh my god! It was just lethal. It was perfect lethal. After barely enduring the onslaught, AKA turn one lethal. Okay. Not too worried. doesn't overflow if we don't hit a target, though. All right. I'm going to see if we can just cut the moon. <laughs> can we just cut the moon? Ah. Close your eyes. Not that that really matters on this phase. All right. Well, I mean, we've won. Uh. Oh. Nah! Wait. Ah, weird. Okay, yeah, it just, it skips over it. Wait, so... Ijerak? 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 The Ijerak actually makes this fight unlosable as well. That's nice. I mean, I've never lost the moon fight, though. I, I guess I assume you can. But it's never happened for me.
Oh. Oh, that's right. It costs three. All right. Stream kill. Bye bye. Man, that was the easiest run yet. New campfire meta is cracked. Four misplays. Sounds about right. <laughs> Boss is defeated for cards drawn 119, biggest attack 18, squirrels harm. That was just, that was bork. New lore. I've been playing this new inscription now for a few days. Work has been unproductive. I emailed some of the other devs, kind of probing to see if they know anything about this without appearing crazy. No dice. Strange thing, the game is fun. Like, it's actually a good game. But Stranger still, Leshy? He talks to the challenger almost as if he's talking to me. It's freaky, but not altogether unwelcome. I could use a friend. We have unlocked the flying... <gasps> a new ant card. We can make it work, Copium. Uh, the power and toughness of a flying ant is equal to the number of ants. Wait, and the toughness? Power. It says power and toughness, but it says it has one health. So. Is. Okay. Uh, we'll strike an opponent directly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's pretty decent. Whoa! Hey, this, uh, we get this upgrade on, uh, this is the first time we, there's a card with this in this mode. This was a rank, or a part two thing, at least, or part three. First time Mud Turtle would take damage, prevent that damage. I think it was a part three thing. Maybe there was a card part two that I just hadn't seen yet. Oh, that's so cool. First time Mud Turtle will take damage, prevent that damage. That is such a good buff to get. All regular battles are replaced with totem battles. Oi. How much do we need to get? 40? 40. That's 20 challenge points. We could do something like that. I I I yeah, I think we can. I think we can make it work. I think we can make it work. My only bummer with this is um the totem battles have a distinctive visual effect filter to them. That I, I, I don't know, I kind of prefer the visual, the normal visual lighting effects of the, the matches. So it's a, kind of a bummer that they're all going to be totem fights in that way. But, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll probably try it out at the very least once. But uh, I believe that there are t ow, 12 challenge levels <laughs> for us to climb. So we got to keep getting climbing. But for now, we're, we're kind of wrecking it. Um, new fire meta changes changes everything about how I think about this game. Because I was going to say, deck bloat is, this is the number one thing that I hear people complaining about in this game is deck bloat, myself included. What if the campfire was the answer? <laughs> you know? It's, it's so elegant. It's so accidentally elegant. You're either, you either have an OP card or you remove a card. That's it's just so good. It's so simple, so dumb that I hadn't like, you know, just not wanting to risk it on it. It's because you want I want the buff. You want the buff on your cool cards, but no, you don't want the buff on your cool cards. You want to buff up your uncool cards. That's the thing. That's the thing. It, it, uh, night and day. I think we're gonna have a, an easier time from here on out. Uh, but alas, alas, that's that. That's gonna do it for today. If you want more inscription, Casey's mod, you gotta like the video. You gotta comment down below if you'd be sad to see it go, because you gotta let me know. So, please go down, do that. Thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you. Check out the channel for roguelikes and more every single day. And I will see you next time. Bye.